Welcome back to my channel. What I got here is a variable bush viper. Look how cool this snake is. All right, let's let's do a general overview of snakes. Let's learn today. So over the course of the millennia, thousands of species of snake have evolved and they're dispersed throughout the world. So out of all these species of snake that are different, they all have things in common too, such as a forked tongue, lidless eyes, scales covering the body, the lack of functioning limbs. These are just a few. How cool is that? But like any other animal, all snakes have to interact with their uh, environment. They have to find food to survive. They have to be able to stay away from predators, not get eaten. So they have adapted through all of this being a limbless creature. It's amazing. Another thing is, they all have to reproduce, of course, and they have to make it to that age where they are able to sexually reproduce. Even snakes that eat other snakes, like king cobras, they have to find mates and reproduce. I'm trying to get him to look, he's looking at you. So throughout all these years, evolution, natural selection, they all have evolved certain characteristics, differences. So throughout this, there, that's why there's some snakes that are very large, and there's some that are very small. But you usually typically hear about the large ones because they're just so magnificent. Things like anaconda, reticulated python, and of course the king cobra, the largest venomous snake. These are the ones that you hear about most. But these large snakes are the minority. The majority of snakes are small or medium size. So some other variations are the body form. You know, some are short and fat, some are thin and long, different things in order to survive in different environments. So there's lots of the ground dwelling vipers that are the fat, heavy bodied snakes. And then when you think of cobras and other elapids, you think of little thinner, longer snakes. And not to mention burrowing snakes, tiny, some very small, very thin. So as these, these animals have their internal organs molded into this tube-like body, and most of these organs are the same things that we have as humans, but they have to fit and they're arranged differently in snakes. Just so amazing. So many organs are elongated and many of the paired ones are staggered instead of side by side in order to fit in the bodies. Now let's talk about the behavior of snakes. So the way each species look is often linked to the way that the snake behaves. So therefore, Snakes have diverse methods in capturing and subduing prey, reproducing, hunting, and where they live. And some of these behaviors are influenced by natural selection, but it might not be that apparent, like why some snakes uh, lay eggs while others give live birth. These things evolved over time for different reasons. Now to end it, let's end it on the future of snakes. The sad thing and the reality is that they're disappearing in many parts of the world due to human involvement, either deforestation or flat out killing them, like at, down in Texas, the rattlesnake roundups. So we gotta learn how to live with these animals because we don't want them disappearing. They're very important for the environment and just play a very critical role in the ecosystem. So it's up to us in order to educate and teach people their importance and why they need to be here. They play an important part in keeping vermin down. And what does that do? That gets rid of lots of diseases that are harmful to humans. Disease carrying mice, rodents, and even ticks that are on these animals that they consume. And they also play a critical role in other animals' lives the snake animals that eat snakes so they're just they just deserve to be here they have every right to be here 
Come on, we can't just kill something based on how they look. Let's look at how they behave. Snakes want nothing to do with us. They just want to live their life. They're not out to hurt people. They're only defensive animals. So let's protect these guys and learn about them. So join me on this journey. All right, guys, take care. If you enjoyed, please subscribe.